Philadelphia police are investigating recent homicides in a Germantown neighborhood. One deadly drive-by shooting was recorded on surveillance video. Alicia Reed is at police headquarters tonight where they're hoping the public can help them solve this case. Alicia, good evening. Good evening, Yuki. That's right. Two homicides within weeks on the streets of Germantown Avenue. Now the local masjid is taking matters into their own hands to keep the area safe. Meanwhile, police today releasing surveillance video of one of those homicides. New faces on a strip of Germantown Avenue where multiple shootings left two men dead. Their presence to deter violence. We'll post up right here. Sometimes we're walking up, uh, you know, they see us, they kind of just go on the other side of the street or into the store. Um, and sometimes we'll purposely stand up there just to be a presence. A presence needed after a series of deadly shootings here. Police have released surveillance video from the August 19th shooting where six people were shot and one man killed. We had to carry the individual. To a car to rush him to the hospital. Unfortunately, he passed away. The dark colored Chevy Impala pulled up to the 5100 block of Germantown Avenue, and two men fired into the crowd of people. Three weeks later, just a few blocks away, in front of a building owned by the Germantown Masjid, a triple shooting left one man dead. Could be anybody, and that's what we're trying to prevent. You know, we want to make it safe for people to come and shop. You know, for businesses to flourish. The masjid immediately hired security to patrol the area. We need this, man. I appreciate you, man. They now show up every day, twice a day, at random hours. Due to the fact that we don't have a set time, they never know when we're coming, so that always helps. While security steps up to keep crime at a minimum, police want you to keep an eye out for a 2000 to 2005 blue gray Chevy Impala with dark gray tinted windows. A spare tire with no hubcap mounted on the left rear side and a white decal on the lower center of the rear window. There's a greater good, and the greater good is to be safe and secure. Now, that security has been hired for the next year. After that, the masjid will reassess. Now, in the matter of those homicides, there is a $20,000 reward being offered for information leading to an arrest and conviction of the people responsible. Reporting live from police headquarters, Alicia Reed, CBS3 Eyewitness News.